as Jesus was making his way to Jerusalem, he came near to Bethphage and Bethany at the Mount of Olives. And he said to a couple of his disciples, I want you to go into the tomb and just inside the gate you'll find a wee cuddy tied up. Nobody's ever ridden this cuddy by the way. I want you to untie it and bring it to me. And if anybody asks you what you're doing, just you tell them the maester has need of it. So off they went, the pair of them, and sure enough, they found everything just as Jesus had told them. But just when they were untying the cuddy, somebody bawled out. Ha! Oh, yous! What do you think you're doing stealing that cuddy? And they replied, the, the, the maester has need of it. And that's all they needed to say. So they brought this wee cuddy to Jesus and they put their jackets on his back for a saddle and Jesus rode down towards Jerusalem. And all the disciples were singing their hair suit because of all the miracles done by Jesus. And all the people, they put their shawls in the way for him to ride over and, and they were cutting down palm branches while they were chanting and, and they were shouting, Ride on! Ride on! Here comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna to the King! The Pharisees in the crowd were only too pleased to all the carry on and shouted, Hey, Jesus, tell them to cut you all that shouting. But Jesus said to them, Hodge your feast. If I tell them to be quiet, even the stones would cry out. When Jesus came in sight of Jerusalem, his mood changed. In fact, in fact, he was greeting, broken hurt it. Oh, Jerusalem, he cried. If you only can't, if you could only see the peace that I could give you, but it's hidden for your own. You will not look and you're determined not to understand. And what's going to happen to you? Your enemies are going to crush you. Aye, and all your wings too. Just because you did not recognise when God himself came riding up to you. Aye, on a wee cuddy. <laughs> <laughs> 